video on how to use and operate the washer extractor that are currently housed at stations two and four. Uh, just some basic things. The settings on the washer extractor are NFPA compliant. Your turnout laundry detergent is NFPA compliant and your laundry sand sanitizer uh, which is, a, uh, is EPA certified. Um, the, Washer extractor can hold up to four sets of gear. Just make sure that your outer shell and inner lining is separated. Uh, I'll go over more of that later on in the video. Uh, once you have everything loaded into the extractor, you'll need to uh, determine what type of uh, cycle you want to put it on. There's four different cycles that you can see right there, which I go uh, over later on in the video. Once you determine which cycle you want to use, uh, you'll just come over here and you'll use these four controls buttons along with this remote. This remote talks to the pump uh, back there. All that needs to be done is by using your up, up and down arrows is selecting what cycle you wanna be on. Once you've selected that cycle, you come down here, you'll match the cycle up, okay? Up and down, one, two, three, four. So go back to uh, two. Two and two, once I'm done, go over here, hold the start button down, and the wash will begin. More about the detergent. Uh, these cups down here hold up to eight ounces of detergent. We wanna make sure that once they are halfway, that the container itself is empty, and we need to get it changed out. Uh, before you do a wash, if you are at halfway, want to make sure that you get a full bottle in before you start that wash, just in case uh, if you do a heavy heavy soil type uh, cycle, you may it may need more than just half. So be mindful of that when you use it. Uh, if you do see any leaks on the pump system, all you have to do is come over here and flip that switch right there. Uh, please notify a paid guy or a station officer. So, we can go through the proper channels of getting a representative out from Scott to fix to fix uh, the pump the pump in the lines. Um, these are real easy to change out. All we have to do, is, for an example, is just make sure you unscrew the top, and this is what the uh, connection will look like. You're going to flip it upside down and just make a connection on the inside and turn it until it's secure. Um, other than that. Pretty much it. If you have any questions, uh, you know, feel free to ask. And uh, hope you guys enjoy washing your gear.